Once again, I'm searching on the internet, looking far and wide for all of these bloody cringe videos, like the one yesterday and the day before. But this one's a bit different. I was asked to do this one. So I'm not going to explain no more. This is probably the most controversial thing on the internet. So... This is a message for anybody who thinks gay marriage is right. So you're writing a message to basically everyone because a lot of people agree with it, a lot more than people who disagree with it. Like, I don't want to hurt you, but loads of governments are bringing it in now, so they support it, like President Obama, and that supports it. The Pope's even admitted he supports it. So, yeah, you want to send a message to all of them. Yeah. Yeah. It's not okay. What? You're on about your mind? Is your mind not fucking okay or some shit? Because that awkward long silence sort of tells me you are like that, but you got refused or some shit. Because you just sound like you've gone to your girlfriend's house or some fucking shit like that. Asked her for a marriage, or she asked you for marriage. And you just got fucking rejected. It sounds like that. It does sound like you've been just rejected by someone. You don't know how much it upsets God. That's right, God. The one who controls everything. Well, if he controls everything, don't you think he'd control that men and women would go together? But if he really controls everything, that would happen, wouldn't it? Logical sense is beyond this person another thing like i say pope he's meant to be like his second hand man doing all that and he agrees with it so you're basically making shit points and i really believe that he controlled fucking hitler and all the other psychopaths who go around killing people i honestly do not believe it if he controls everything, he wouldn't let shit like that happen. Okay, the way that you live. And you don't appreciate. Okay, she's definitely been dumped or something. Or one of the best friends is gay or something. As you wouldn't act like that going, point looking down to the floor. Wouldn't appreciate it. You don't do that shit. Unless you know someone who's doing that. Or someone who is like that has done something to you. You wouldn't do that. And to upload this shit to the internet, sorry I'm eating a polo, but uh, to upload this shit to the internet is beyond stupid. In the Bible, the Bible, that's right, it says that no man should lie together, no two men should lay together in bed, sexually. If the Bible says it, we must do it. We must also treat women like shit. Because that's what's represented in the Bible. Go around raping women and slaughtering them. Because that's what happens in the Bible. So yeah, everybody get your fucking knives out and shit. Because this woman says that you've got to follow the Bible. I'm not I'm not saying all of it's bullshit. Some of it's religious and thing. But you can't just say it because the Bible says it. It means it's right. Because even in the Bible as well... They're against different people with different people, whatever it is, different nationalities and stuff like that. They're, it's against that, which is not right. So, whatever you say. As in, as in sexually. Okay, okay, if two men were laying in bed, I don't think they could do that unless one's a transgender. So, once again, your sense is beyond your fucking head, isn't it? I just don't understand why so many people want to be gay. What's up with you? There's obviously something up with you to actually think. I know what I'm going to do to get YouTube views. I'm going to make a video calling out gay marriage because it's elite. It's legal now. So yeah, I bet she didn't even fucking read the Bible, has she? End of day, she's just. Thinks she knows best. 
and there's obviously something up with her. But I don't, I don't, I don't question what's up with her. I don't question what's going on in that fucking head of hers, do I? If it's against the Bible, they know that if they're gay, they know that that they're gonna go to hell because in the Bible it says you're gonna go to hell if you sin, and being gay is a sin. So being from another nationality is a sin. So if you're from Africa or anywhere like that, you're off to hell apparently. Um, if you like me, where you're swearing in the videos every five minutes, you're off to hell. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm. I don't think it works for everything. Another thing, if you don't rape, rape women, you're off to hell as well because apparently that's advised in the Bible, so good one. Do you want to know what, to all you gay people out there, do you want to know what this one is? What I think is gay marriage. What is that? Gay marriage. It's fire. <laughs> is this guy fucking, this girl, of, I can't tell with that fucking haircut, but um, is this person real? This is what I think of gay man who goes up to the fucking fire pit, throws it, misses. Gets it all on the floor, picks it up, and is like, fuck's sake! Mm. In hell. You could be married, you could be gay married in hell. So, I get this right, she said you can be gay married in there, so if you're gay, you need to get married in a cardboard box. Yeah, you, um, you'll probably find one outside Netto, Asda, Tesco, Morrison's, anywhere you find a cardboard box. Get your wedding rings out, and you can get married. Do you want to burn up in flames? Because that's what's waiting for you if you continue to be gay. Well, if you were born about 300 years ago, you'd be burnt on a fucking stick for looking like a witch. So, yeah, and also when you're talking about hell and stuff, if you would have done that all them years ago, if anybody's going up in flames, it's you, love. It's a sin. Gay is a sin. There's obviously something up with it because she's pausing for like five seconds every time. It's like, she's coming up with this at the top of her head. She doesn't even know the facts. She's just saying it in the Bible because she doesn't know what the fuck she's on about. And you can just tell. Oh, and another thing about love wins, hashtag love wins. That is so stupid. That offends people. It offends me. Why? Because no one loves you or something. Oh, you ne you're never going to have a boyfriend or all. Oh, wait. I've, I've seen your channel. You have got a boyfriend. You, you, it's a bit weird when I think your boyfriend has longer hair than you. So maybe you're all for gay marriage now, aren't you? That's probably what she meant by the sign language earlier. Because maybe that's the person who rejected her. And... All right, maybe she found out that he wasn't who he said he was, and then she made this video. So, that explains a lot. Because it's a sin, and I know a lot of people are going to hell for that. They're going to hell because they're going, because, because they want to be gay. I don't understand why you want to be gay. I don't understand why you think this YouTube video were appropriate, but anyway, you made it anyway. And it, it, it shows that no one likes it because seeing as though you got 13k down likes. My worst video's got 87. A penis was made for a vagina and a vagina was made for a penis. Not a penis and a penis and a vagina and a vagina. If you took biology class, if you took sexual education, then you would know that. But you don't. Well, I, pro I do know this, but I know there's something else that I learnt from an even earlier age, from fucking Disney films, that true love, he comes in all shapes and sizes, and you learn that at a young age, so, yeah, that, that just shows that you're a fucking dumb bitch, but, I'm sorry for telling you that, but you are. And I'm just so sick of it. I just don't know why people just don't want to listen. It's like, I just don't get why somebody would want to be gay. So 
the last time. I do not get why you thought it were appropriate to make a video like this. But you have anyway. I'm a Christian. Okay? And there's some gay Christians out there who still, they know what the Bible says and they still go against it. And I don't know why. I... Well, if they're going against the Bible and you don't know why, I, I think a lot of people don't know why you, you haven't been raped yet. Because, like I say, the Bible wants that to happen. So, why didn't it happen to you? And why have we got a black president now if we, the Bible is so, is so significant in life? This just makes me so sick of it. That's all. You just sound like a strappy little child when they can't get what they want. I'm, I just don't understand why you sound like that. Another thing, not related to the video, I'm having to use some more gameplay because I used all my gameplay I had up for this. So, I just, I just don't understand why. My rant, and then if you haters or people that say hashtag love wins comments on this, then I don't care because I still stick to my opinions like a true American. So that's right. If you comment on this video, well, I'm sorry, but you disabled comments on your video, so I'm guessing that you backed out on that. Like, why? Literally, you cannot comment on this video, even though she's on about comments. She's even got in the description about comments, yet you can't even comment on the damn video. So, she makes even more sense there. And like a true American, when a lot of Americans, including your president, agree with it. So, you don't make any sense. Anyway, thanks for watching. Link to the original video in the description. Bye.